Hey guys, when I saw the Mexican runner beat the infamous Turbo Tunnel blindfolded at AGDQ in 2018, I immediately thought of doing the same with Hog Wild from Crash Bandicoot. And six years later, I finally decided to give it a go. So, whenever you're ready, I'm Jacobson, and welcome to Accelerate and Fireballs. This being my first blindfolded challenge, if you will, I figured a logical place to start would be to get through the level with as few inputs as possible. So I tried to optimize my movements and whenever I was satisfied with a part of the level, I'd count the footsteps. Hoof steps? Uh, noting how many steps to listen for between each button press. And as soon as I had a full run going, I went on to practice while only looking at my notes. But after trying for a while, my playing just didn't feel consistent. And I was starting to get frustrated and I needed a break. I'm also After making some adjustments, I finally felt my setup was good enough to memorize. Then, it was time to try some actual blindfolded runs. Okay, let's try this for real. It's time to become Buckethead. This bucket is a bit tight. And after only a few tries, this happened. So fucking close. It's not comfortable at all. Let's do t-shirt and bucket. But it seemed the early success was just a fluke, as the following attempts didn't go quite as well. Ah. After a couple of hours of failing, I concluded that the bucket was holding me back, so I switched out my makeshift blindfold and kept going. <laughs> Oh. 
And just as I was about to quit for the day, I got this run. I really enjoyed doing this, making the game into sort of timing-based audio puzzle. Let me know if I should do any more of these. Thanks for watching, and uh, until next time. Ooh, I want to do that.